and a huge match in prospect here at Ibrox this afternoon as Elena Sedico's side face up against Rangers. Some understandable disappointment amongst the Celtic supporters with the inability to get to today's match. But Elena Sedico will be hoping for another good performance from her side. The ball swung in and an early chance for Rangers as Ross drags it wide of the post from about 12 yards out. And just starting on the front foot. The ball swung in. It's not cleared away. Rangers still with it in the penalty area. The ball's up and it's off the bar. The chance is still there, but it's headed over. Well, Rangers have started this match with real attacking intent. Two good early chances. Tash Flint floats the ball towards Partido. Ball sent forward to Kit Lafersky. And we know just how good she can be from these wide positions. She drives into the area, still goes, looks for Natalie Ross, but the pass is cut out at the pivotal moment, but it's still with Celtic as Partido picks up and gives the ball to Shen. Looks across the box, Amy Gallagher gets the touch. Just not enough conviction on that. Rangers search for the long pass. And the touch is good. And it sets up a good chance here, but Kelsey Doherty, she was swift and brave there to get out, close down the space, and ultimately end that attack. Lovely dummy in the middle of the park from Shen, which allows Caitlin Hayes the chance to advance with the ball. She looks up, Gallagher was there, she lays it back to Natalie Ross from distance, but again, it's not enough conviction on the shot. Celtic starting to build some chances of their own here. Tash Flint picks up the ball in the middle of the park and looks for Shen. He'll drift that ball out to the right-hand side. Partido, can she make something of this? Ball returns to Shen, lovely pass back to Partido, who sends it to the edge of the area, the shot from Flint. This is a bit more like it from Celtic. Flint will be disappointed not to have hit the target there, but some good play in the build-up. Yep. Celtic will be looking to build on their Good display in the first half, a few chances. We we'll hope to make something of one of the chances in this half as Lafersky chases the ball once again on the right-hand side. Amy Gallagher's made a wonderful run. She's picked it up. She's cut it back. Tash Flint with the chance. She's back in the hoops and she's back among the goals. Following on for her double against Hibernian, Tash Flint opens the scoring at Ibrox. It's 1-0 to Celtic. The threat of Kit Lafersky on the right-hand side. She picks up Amy Gallagher, who knocks it through to Flint. And she makes no mistake as she finds the bottom corner. Partido out there, shutting down the space. Picks up on the ball. She's slack with it, though. And now Rangers will have a chance to try and break into the area. Balls drifted across, the header off the post. And Kelly Clark's out there to shut that down. That was a good opportunity for Hardy. Rangers will feel that they should be on level terms. Doherty sends that long. And Mingle will pick up on that on the left-hand side. A good chance developing here as Ming Lu finds Tash Flint and Tash Flint with a real chance and she's dragged it wide of the post. Well, what an opportunity that was to make it 2 0 to Celtic. Tash Flint will be disappointed that she couldn't find the target there. Partido. He is Celtic enjoying having some of the ball just now as the cross comes in. A decent delivery. And we'll pick up on that. 
just outside the area. Flint knocks it inside to Coley Craig. Feel of a pop from distance. Not the worst effort. Had to force a save there from the Rangers keeper. Loses out. The Rangers will go long with the ball. That's oh, a good touch. Rangers have a player over. It's McCauley with a chance. And eventually Rangers do take advantage of one of the chances. A tidy finish. And it's one each here at Ibrooks. Ball played long. Back to the keeper. Doherty. She's that into the middle of the park. Celtic will be searching for another goal and looking to take the lead once again in this match as Hayes wins that and releases Murphy Agnew. A real chance for Celtic here to make it 2-1. Agnew on the right foot. And it's a good save from the keeper, but Murphy Agnew feels she could have done better there. She does everything right. Shot that saved. Rangers once again go long into the middle of the pitch. And that ball's going to be sent through. Caitlin Hayes loses out. Ross goes round the keeper. Could this be the moment for Rangers? No. Caitlin Hayes is big, she's strong, and she prevents Rangers from taking the lead. A wonderful opportunity for the home side there. Caitlin Hayes rectifies the mistake. And the full-time whistle goes here at Ibrooks. Celtic with a point away from home. Rangers 1, Celtic 1.